The steep-sided bowl of the stadium was packed, bathed in the blue and red light of the two team colors of the Laver Cup. The high-octane event, all dry ice and pounding techno, not exactly Wimbledon center court, is a team format, played over three days. But ever since Federer's retirement was announced last week, every ticket holder knew this was no longer about Team Europe or Team World. This was Roger's night. One last match, partnering Rafa Nadal in doubles. A bowing out of Federer's own design. Apparently, nobody had told Andy Murray. At almost 10 p.m., three hours after the official start time, that other great tennis player was finally beaten in the first singles tie of the evening, by the Australian Alex de Minor, representing Team World. Murray's matches these days are often drawn out affairs, and the crowd was restless. We were waiting for history. The superfans, some of whom had paid up to a rumored $25, oh 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 for tickets on resale sites, wanted their due. Tantalizingly, Federer had been there all evening on the Team Europe bench, alongside a supergroup of fellow players including Rafa Nadal and Novak Djokovic, shouting encouragement to the Brit.